Yes. All right, guys, let's look at some stuff to do with breaking a rear stranglehold like this. Now, there are several things to remember here. Unfortunately, you have to do them all pretty much at the same time. Just put the choke on there, John. Either the way, my voice went there very quickly. You have a very limited time frame in which to make this work. Once the guy puts the choke on, especially a skinny, bony guy like this, he gets his wrist right there in the azimuth apple. Life gets a bit rough very quickly. So, the first thing I try and do is make my neck strong. So I grimace, my throat strong, sorry. Grimace, hiss, go. <sighs> Got you. <sighs> ah, there. I felt a lot better, but that gives me a little chance, okay? So I grimace, hiss straight away. At the same time, I reach down here, grab aggressively at his trousers. If I find his nuts, great, grab and pull. There, I've just managed to get a little bit of his trousers. I do this so he can't pull me backwards. If I'm like this and John pulls me back, once my balance goes, life gets very tough for me. So, grimace, grab. At the same time, this hand comes up here towards his wrist. Do not dick about trying to do all this sort of stuff to him here, take his eyes. I don't know how he's standing. If he looks that way, I can't get a decent shot there, and I'm wasting time. My priority is to break this choke. The same with all this stuff here where you come back and elbow the guy. If the guy's a little bit big, if it's winter time and you've got a coat on, these sort of blows don't make any difference. My priority has to be to break here. You have a relatively short space of time to work. So, grab, grimace, elbow height, shrug the shoulder, fingers towards his wrist. So this, no impact. Elbow height, shrug the shoulder, I have a chance. Again, at the same time as I do this, turn like this, tuck in my chin, the elbow goes back in. So one more time with that. He puts on the choke. <clears throat> now, I have a chance. This leg, keep it tight there, John. This leg, I now get behind him aggressively like so. Turn to look at him. This hand in his face pushes him away. This arm passes between, bang, then I can take the guy. So, your priority is to break the choke. All right, and to stop the guy pulling you back. Elbow high, shrug the shoulder, still hurt. Turn like this, elbow in, stick your ass out here like a crack whore. I can bring the leg behind aggressively like this. I turn to look. If I do this, if we fall, we fall that way. If I'm like this, we fall together. So make sure if you fall, you fall on top of his ribs. This hand pushes his head away. This arm passes here, push him like so. My own head pushed back tall like this. Take a strike at the guy and do it. Now one more little bit of bullshit to beware of here. If the guy puts a decent choke on you, this idea I can come around like this and just release the back here. If you've got a grip like this, then I can pull away here. But a good, aggressive, determined attacker is not going to let me do that. Well, there's no way here I'm going to pull away. So this leg gets behind. Then I have room for the technique. Ush. Okay.